Hello guys, good morning. Welcome to my channel. So today I am here with the new recruitment notification from a central government PSU. So this is one of a very good opportunity for all the students who are waiting for such kind of jobs. And the state-wise vacancies has been released by the PSU. So as you can see on the screen, for West Bengal, Assam, Uttar Pradesh, Bihar, Jharkhand, Delhi, Haryana, Punjab, Uttar Pradesh, Rajasthan, Madhya Pradesh, almost Gujarat, almost all the states has been covered. You can see the other page also Maharashtra, Tamil Nadu, Andhra Pradesh, Odisha, Chhattisgarh and Andhra Pradesh. So these are the total number of states where the PSU is having its plants, uh, the vacancies has been called for and the number of vacancies has been present um, corresponding to the state that has been present and also the name of the post is present. Okay. So these are the complete uh, uh, vacancy details that has been released. Okay. And now let us see from where this notification has been released. Okay. So it has been released from Indian Oil Corporation Limited at Government of India undertaking pipe, Pipelines Division. So recruitment for filling of non-executive vacancies in pipeline divisions. So applications are invited from eligible Indian nationals for the following non-executive vacancies in the various locations in pipelines divisions as per the given details below. So uh, the last date is 18th uh, February. Still uh, uh, nine days of time is present for you to apply. Okay, this is from Indian Oil, Indian Oil Corporation. Now let us see the other details that has been provided. So the names of the post has been present here. So the first one is in engineering assistant mechanical. So three years full uh, diploma in any following disciplines of engineering. Okay. Uh, if you have done ITI and uh, joint diploma also, then you are eligible. And minimum percentage is 55% marks for uh, unreserved OBC WS. For, as for SCST, just the passing marks. And engineering assistant electrical, the same thing. Uh, elect, uh, diploma in electrical engineering or electrical and electronics engineering. And for the third one, engineering assistant T&I. Uh, three years diploma in any of the following disciplines of engineering that is electronics and communication, electronics and telecommunication, electronics and radio, instrumentation and control, instrumentation process and electronics engineering and the same marks criteria is uh, similar and engineering assistant here also the uh, diploma students who have done their uh, uh, diploma in engineering with, this, with respect to these uh, branches are eligible. And for the technical attendant, uh, matriculation pass and ITI pass from a government recognized institute in specified to ITI trades and duration mentioned below. Okay. So these are the different uh, eligibility criteria that is the educational qualification that, has requ that are required for these different types of courses. Okay. And then uh, they will only give you training. Okay. After training, uh, then you will get a permanent job. Okay. And the pace and perk is very good here because the even though it has been mentioned, uh, the uh, scale as 25,000 to 1,5,000 uh, the scale has been mentioned but uh, uh, after including basic pay, DA, HRA, everything it, the uh, salary will almost reach up to 45 to 50,000 okay and the application fee is just 100 rupees so this is a very good uh, choice for you all because just 100 rupees can be done and SESC students are exempted from this uh, fees and the cutoff date for age qualification everything will be on 24-1-2022 okay and uh, age relaxation will be provided as per the central government norms and uh, there will be one written test or a, uh, and skill test. So there are two tests, that's it, no interview or nothing. So one written test and one skill test will be present. And uh, return word, uh, the date has also been announced. It is on 27th March, Sunday. Written test will be on this. There shall be 100 marks in written test 100, 100, uh, for 100 marks. Okay. For engineering assistant out of 100, 75 questions will be from engineering discipline and 25 from the general aptitude QRE section. Okay. This is the normal uh, uh, division of criteria that has been mentioned in almost all the uh, subjects I mean examinations so the tentative dates has been mentioned here the last date is 18th February please remember that and the return test is 27 3 2022 and for the skill test it will be by uh, April 1st okay these are the tentative dates that has been mentioned and the examination center uh, will be present on almost uh, all uh, all over India uh, depending upon the applications so don't worry about that if you are eligible please apply for this job since the fees is also very less okay so these were the complete details guys if you like the video please like it and share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel that's all for today thank you